Use your data. I can't believe they got this one wrong. Zero out of ten. Good job, guys. You're gonna have a hard road ahead, that's for sure. Hey, uh, Mr. Bullen, you got a minute? Hey, Dean, how you doing? I'm doing well. Uh, I'm glad we actually have this opportunity to talk because mm -hmm. your students' grades are far too low for this to be acceptable. Yeah. Uh, this is something we need to work on. It's oh, something yeah, yeah. as a school we. we yeah, uh, I'm working we on just it. Just don't know well. Uh, I, yeah. I got it. Well, I know. You've been here so long, I, you know, I just... No, I, know. Uh, I need you. this job. You know that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry about your dad. Yeah. Uh, he's a good guy. Can you show me, possibly, what you've got going on, like, uh, uh, yeah, after school today? Printer, because... Yeah, yeah, I'll print it out. Um, I just got to run over to Staples, so it'll be like two seconds. Uh, yeah, I can, uh, it's like the only way these We supply can... printers for you guys. You, you don't have to go to Staples. Oh, okay, yeah, I'll use those then. Uh, I just, I'm... Just trying to figure out the best thing for the curriculum. It's like these kids, I got to make it film or poetry or dance oriented or else they won't even open their ears. <laughs> this is a very serious situation. I don't yeah. think you quite understand. Uh, no, I get it. I don't have dinner. I'm having these children's parents call me up day after day and they're stressed out because their students yeah. can't keep up their grades. And these students are in college. I shouldn't be having calls from their yeah. parents. I know, I know. Uh, well... That's just the type of kids you reel in here, but I'm going to do my best, and I'm going to get this worked around. Don't worry, I have a new idea for the curriculum. I'm going to base it all around their majors. It's the only way I'm going to do anything. Well, It'll thank goodness. Out. Have a printout for me by uh, lunch this afternoon, Okay. and well, I'll see you after school. Okay. Yep. We'll get that graduation. Glad we had this up. talk. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, you think you can do my job? Yeah. It's up there in your palace. You haven't even been here that long. Uh... I'll show you how to do it. I'll show you how to teach these kids. You guys don't even try in this class. So? Put the phone away, please. No. Put it away now. You want to grow up like an idiot? You're not you mean gonna, like you? You're not going to be an artist, at least I'm a teacher. No, I'm going to be an artist. You're not going to make any money. Yeah, we'll see. You're having a hard time paying off your loans. I'll make more than you. Why don't you even respect me? Well, hello, Mr. Bullen. Hey. I'm glad we have the opportunity to have this talk because if your kids don't bring their grades up, I'll personally see to it that you'll be spending the next 10 years in detention. You know, you have open admissions in this place. You bring in just the worst kids. They're idiots to begin with. I just, what do you expect? I expect 100%! 110%! I'm trying so hard with these kids, they just... Not hard enough. You're letting me down. I'm not letting you down, this is third grade homework. You should have, this is basic math. You just... Have you ever even walked outside? This is the world you live in. Maybe it's me that's letting you down. I know it is. That's what I've been saying. I Maybe just... you ought to show them a lesson. You should teach me a lesson. A lesson he'll never forget. Yeah. Well, I, I put it in front of you guys. Don't get it all. Nail it in your stupid heads. I'll show you kids! I'll show you a lesson!
Who is it? Sorry to come so late. I was wondering if you could uh, help me with my physics homework. With your what? With my physics homework. You came to my house. Yeah, I mean, I I'm sorry it's late. I you just thought maybe work you in could. The classroom, so you came all the way to my house. No, I mean, yeah, I, I just wanted to see if you could answer a couple questions for me. I mean, I'll help you with your physics homework. I'm helping you with your physics homework. Please, please, Mr. Bond, don't do this. What is this? What are how, you doing? How high up do you think we are, Nathan? What? Take your guess. I don't know, like 30 feet? No, 30 feet, good job. Now just convert that into meters. It'll probably be like, like 9.14 or something. That's right, Nathan. Why don't you go on and calculate how long a free fall would take from this height? Just give me a second, okay? Just, just give me a second. Let me, let me think. Okay. Okay, think, Nathan. Think, 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 think. Okay, okay. Okay, so I know that I'm 30 feet up, which is 9.14 meters. Um, oh, darn, Nathan, think. Okay, so I know that height equals half of gravity multiplied by times squared. Yeah, yeah, okay, that sounds right. So if I rearrange that and I plug in my variables, I get around uh, 1.38 seconds. Okay, 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 great. And and I know to find impact velocity, you find the square root of two times gravity times height, which means the impact velocity is 13.4 uh, meters per second. Oh, sh oh shit. Wait, uh, if kinetic energy is one, one half mass times velocity squared, then my kinetic energy is 7,532.5 joules. Oh dear. So let's see. My kinetic energy is 7,532.5 joules. My impact velocity is 13.4 meters per second, and the time of the fall is 1.38 seconds. Is that right? Oh, that is super right, Nathan. That's how long it's gonna take you to hit the ground. No, no, no! I knew you'd die from this because of physics. That's right. How does it feel, Mr. Bullen? Awesome. That's right. Nathan! Mr. Bullen, what happened? Take this. You'll know what to do. You still alive? I killed you with physics. Forgot one thing, Mr. Boland. This is a movie, and in movies, physics don't have to apply. No! Well, Nathan, you okay? Yeah. You think uh, you think we got an A in our project? No, 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 no probably not. No. I want to teach kids. All I want to do is teach the kids. We've had a lot of fun here today, but I think it's time for something on a more serious note. 
As your dean, I think it's important that all of our students get a very well-rounded education. And physics is a very special part of that education, as you have under gotten the opportunity to understand. You can say that again, Dean. So, study your physics.